A useful new glitch has been found in Pokemon Go, allowing for a single finger quick catch, an improvement on the existing two finger quick catch glitch that has been known for years. The new glitch was introduced with the Reality Blending AR update, and was found by Reddit user Jamif and posted to the Self Road subreddit on May 9, 2024. It was quickly confirmed by other users, including me, and a number of related but less useful bugs were quickly discovered. Jamif included an explanatory video that shows you everything you need to do to use the glitch, which I've linked here and in the description. Please watch it and give him a like and subscribe. This video is intended to get the word out further, help clarify how to perform the glitch, and investigate and confirm some of the other bugs related to this glitch. Welcome to the excellent Pokédex. In this video, we will analyze the one finger quick catch. Let's start with the basic technique. First, let's observe that before entering the buggy state, you can't start a throw from the ball icon. The key to the glitch is to use the new AR features to put the game in a bugged state. This is simple to do, just tap the camera icon on any Pokemon's screen, then place the Pokemon somewhere on the ground. Once it's placed, rotate the Pokemon a little bit using the rotation tool. Do this by dragging around the edges on the Pokemon and then releasing. Once the Pokemon is rotated, tap twice in the upper left corner to exit the AR screen. Now, when you enter an encounter, if you start the throw by dragging from the berry or ball icon, the game will open the berry or ball drawer after you release the throw. This is the familiar state that is entered during a two finger quick catch, but is accomplished here with only one finger. To complete the quick catch, tap anywhere outside the berry or ball drawer, and then tap the flea icon. This buggy state persists as long as the app remains open, and you can complete as many quick catches as you want with a single finger. If you don't want a quick catch, simply don't start the throw from the berry or ball icon, and the throw will behave normally. If you want to leave the buggy state, restart the app. There are some known bad side effects of this glitch. The most important is that while the buggy state is active, charged attacks don't work in raids. Though it appears that you're able to tap the charge attack button, the attack is never triggered. Be careful to restart the app before doing any raids. In my testing, charge attacks still work for gym battles, but there are reports that this isn't the case. I'm not sure why we have different experiences here. In my testing, charge attacks still work for rocket battles and rocket encounters. However, it does make changing Pokemon for a gym battle glitch out. There are reports that it affects feeding berries to gym defenders, but I didn't find that was the case for me, though there was some odd behavior when swiping through berry types. There will likely be other strange side effects discovered, since overall, it seems that this glitch puts the game in a very buggy state, where many things go wrong. It just happens that the one finger quick catch is a happy accident, while most of the other effects are not. Unfortunately for fans of this glitch, I think that the large number of problems caused by this bug will ultimately be its downfall. It's hard to imagine that Niantic will even place such brokenness caused by such basic use of its new AR feature. That said, this technique is very useful, and I would certainly advise using it for mass catching. It solves multiple problems with two-finger quick catching. First, and most obviously, it only requires one hand, which makes it feasible to perform in many more situations. On top of that, it is impossible to miscoordinate the fingers and fail the quick catch, since there is only one motion. And finally, it makes it possible to quick catch marginally faster than before, because the ball or berry drawer pops up instantly once the throw is made. Will you use this new glitch? Do you think Niantic will patch it out? Comment below. Thanks for watching the excellent Pokédex. Please like and subscribe. I'll see you next time.